Today we'll be looking at the balance sheet. The first thing we'll look at is assets. There are two types of assets, current and non-current. For most entities, current assets means cash or cash equivalents, and assets that are expected to be realized or consumed within 12 months of the balance sheet date, while non-current assets are realized or consumed outside of the 12 month period. Next we have liabilities. Sometimes you will find in accounting statements that items are listed in solvency order. According to the standards, certain items must be presented on the face of the statement, including totals for these assets. Cash and cash equivalents, receivables, inventory, PPE, which is property, plant and equipment, intangibles and investment property. Similar to assets, we also have current and non-current liabilities. For most entities, obligations expected to be settled within 12 months of the balance sheet day are current liabilities, while non-current liabilities tend to be settled outside of the 12 month period. As for liabilities, you must show the trades and other payables, provisions and other financial liabilities, interest-bearing debt, and a total for these equity items, contributed equity, share capital and reserves. As for disclosures, PPE is the minimum disclosure. You should add more detail in the footnotes. Provision is a type of liability. It is not required to show retained earnings on the face of the accounting statements, but it will show up in the changes of equity. In our next lecture, we will be discussing merchandising operations.